happy people i'm back with another video and today i'm excited my your nail out box literally just arrived like a few hours ago and i'm excited and i want to get it unboxed for you guys so this is the box this is again for the month of november so let's hop right on into it to see what goodies we got this month y'all look i was so excited i couldn't even wait to do my nails to do the video y'all i want to see what's in here so let's see what we got and it feels like it's heavy Alrighty. Okay, again, y'all know I'm a sucker for the packaging. It just says, your nail up in a box. And then it says, hey babe, right here, which is so cute. Ooh, wow, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and zoom it out just a little bit so we can see. Okay, wow, what is this? Oh, we got the Shimmer Solid watercolors. Oh my gosh, I actually just saw these on Amazon and almost got them. I actually listed something like this on my community tab and I didn't even buy it. And I have my own. Wow, these are really cool. So I've seen um, a couple of people use these on their channels. You're supposed to take a brush with some water and it creates like a really cool like watercolor design. Oh, that's so cool. I love this. Okay, so let's open it up and see. How we, okay. Wow, look at that. Okay, it comes with a gold, a pearly white, a kind of lavenderish purple, a kind of goldish green, a really pretty pink, and like kind of a rusty gold color. And yeah, that's cool. I like that it comes in like its own individual little tray. So I'm gonna have a lot of fun playing around with these, y'all. That is really dope. They ooped that this month. Oh my gosh. Okay, loving that. Next, we have some acrylic. Y'all know I'm really into my acrylic journey and enjoying the McCart acrylic powders. So I got two really cool colors. I got Rose Bouquet, which is this really pretty, like, kind of um, rusty red color with some gold shimmer. That's really pretty. And then I also got Duchess, which is this beautiful, vibrant green. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, so I'll be opening these and swatching them here shortly. We got some dippies y'all i have been waiting to try the mccart dip powders for the absolute longest i hope they actually included dip oh well i guess these are all in one so it's acrylic and a dip so uh, that's cool i guess i'm gonna be doing a dip powder set okay okay we also got a thermal polish wow okay let me slow down y'all i'm too excited so we got the dippy base so we got number one and so that's what you will use to do the um, dip powder application with Ooh, that's strong though. Uh, very, very strong, but it's good. You know, it's interesting because Marla Chris really raves about the McCart um, dip liquids as well as the dip powders. So I've been dying to try them out. So I'm really excited they included that in this month's box. Um, we also have a gel polish called Sunsetter. It looks like it's a thermal polish. That looks really pretty. Oh, wow. That's a really pretty. This is like a really deep green, kind of like a, I don't even maybe like a forest green no more so like an army green and i love that it's a thermal so i'll be excited to see it change into like this really beautiful mustard yellow this is really perfect for the fall time Ooh, we got another uh gel polish it's called fruit fiesta which is like this really beautiful um looks like a coral color oh wow that's a really beautiful vibrant coral absolutely gorgeous love that yeah that's pretty okay so we got that and then we also got a nail liner. Wow, okay, so we got a nail liner and cheerleader. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, so this is a really nice, kind of like pastel, um, kind of like a peachy, like a pastel peachy color. That's really pretty. Okay, McCart, McCart they came through this month, okay? And then what else we got? Um, okay, so this is the card that comes in all the boxes that tells you more about the box and how it was curated. And then last but not least, okay, we have some, it says false nails and glue file. So let's see what we got in here. Ooh, okay. So looks like we got some full cover tips. Wow, along with the McCart nail glue. All right, they, they came out swinging this month. I will... <laughs> I will say I'm very happy with this box, okay? That is a, a lot of cool goodies in here. So let's see how their nail tips look. I love the container that it came in. Okay. So these are what the tips look like. I'll be honest, I'm not the biggest fan of like how big that curve is on this tip. Like it's pretty, 
it's pretty steep you know what I mean like it curls curls down pretty pretty far almost look like a claw a little bit but you know it's nice to have a variety of, like of different nail tips so these are really cool to have um, yeah that's really dope so yeah that's what those look like I love the container that it came in as well as the fact that it came with actual nail glue I've heard good things about the McCart nail glue so I will be excited to give these a try so yeah y'all okay we got a lot of different options here for nail art so I'm gonna go ahead and swatch all of the gel polishes as well as I'm gonna try out the acrylics as dip powder since it did come with a, um, a base coat and yeah I'll be right back first I'm gonna go ahead and swatch sunsetter which is this really beautiful army green color I love this Wow it's a really nice green absolutely beautiful one coat coverage Next, I'm going to go in and swatch Fruit Fiesta. Oh, that's a really beautiful, vibrant, kind of peachy pink. It's like a neon peach color, actually, which I've never seen before. Very nice. And next, I'm going to swatch Cheerleader. And with the nail liners, I really like to go in and see what type of artwork I can do with them, which I always start off with a French tip just because it's easiest for me to practice that one. Yeah, they created a really nice French tip. And I'm also just gonna practice here with the lines. Looks like you can draw really thin or really thick. Yeah, I like that, very nice. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch these all-in-one powders as a dip powder, because it does say it's an acrylic and dip powder system. And I love that they're two ounce containers. First, I'm going to start off with swatching Duchess. This green just looks like it's going to be absolutely stunning, by the way. Wow. It is. That's a really beautiful green. Absolutely stunning. When I swatch my dip powders, I do swatch on the inside of the swatch stick, um, just so that I don't have to apply top coat. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just fill in the inside. And then I'm just going to dip it straight into the container and let it sit there until I swatch my next powder. Ooh, that's pretty. And this is called Rose Bouquet. Gorgeous color. Very nice. This is what one coat of that coverage looks like. Again, one coat coverage. I'm going to go ahead and do the second coat off camera and I'll be right back. So now I want to give these little watercolors a try. I do have a uh, matte nail here. I actually went ahead and just used the cheerleader color. And then I have a dappen dish with just a little bit of water in it. So what I'm going to do is, I got like a little napkin here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to dip my brush inside the water and dab off most of the water. And then I think I'm going to go in, maybe I'll go in with this purple color here. Okay. And just try to pick up a little bit of the color which is coming up. And then I think I've just seen people, maybe I need more water here, just kind of, just kind of spread it on the nail. Like so maybe, I don't know if this, if I'm doing this right or not. It looks cool. And then let me try one other color. I'm going to try the rusty gold, or maybe the, the solid gold, like so. I'm gonna dab a little bit more water on it and then just whoops that's too much <laughs> okay yeah I'm not doing this right at all I just messed up the other color maybe I was supposed to let the first one dry let me try that again all right y'all let's try it again I think I have put too much uh, water on the nail so I'm gonna go in with this purple color one more time and I'm just gonna kind of lightly you know just guide it over like this and I think I need to let it dry. So I'm gonna just let it dry for a little bit. This is what the purple looks like after it's dried. Now I'm gonna go in with that gold color again and give this another try. So you just pick up what you can on the brush here. Then I think I'm just gonna kinda of add it in the spots where there's not too much purple. All right, okay. 
and then I'm gonna just let that air dry. So I'm gonna show you all what everything looks like swatched. This is what the sun setter looks like. Really love this green, it's really pretty. And I wanna show you the color that it changes to. So this is it um, cold, and this is how it looks when it turns hot. That's a really pretty yellow. Yeah, I like that a lot. Next we have Fun Fiesta, which is this really beautiful neon peach color, which I can't say I've seen a neon peach before, but it's really pretty. The Duchess, this is what that looks like. So it's a really beautiful, it just reminds me of like a nice pine green or like a Christmas green color. That's what it would look like matte, glossy. And then we have Rose Bouquet, which is this really beautiful, kind of deep, almost burgundy red with gold shimmers, gold glitters. And that's what it will look like matte. And then we have Cheerleader, which is this really beautiful light peach color. Almost kind of like a nude. And I love that the liner can go from a thin line all the way up to a little bit of a thicker line. For the watercolors, this is just like an idea, like a sample of a design that you could do with it. Um, just gotta make sure you don't use too much water and you let it dry in between each um, color so yeah y'all so this is everything that was included in this month's your nail lab box for November and I'm loving everything that was included if I'm going to be honest with you I love the two colors that they included um, just in time for the holiday season I love this thermal gel polish I love that it turns this really beautiful mustard yellow um, I'm also really loving the fact that they included a dip powder base I do wish they also had have included an activator because you do actually need an activator to actually cure the base um, so that's the only thing I do wish they had have included in this month's box the liner was nice I love that they included these watercolors you all see the cute little design I was able to create with that and these nail tips are really cool too again not the biggest fan of the curve of them but the fact that they included them along with nail glues and a file I'd say I got my money's worth for sure with this month's box. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Let me know what your favorite item was um, that was included in this month's box. And if you all have it, um, I'll be interested to see everyone else's unboxings to see if they got similar items or something different. And so yeah, y'all, I am going to try to create a look with this month's box. Hopefully I can get that out before the end of the month. If not, you all will be seeing me implement these items, use these items in future sets. So yeah, I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Thursdays in particular are my Nail Therapy Thursday premieres where I tune in live with you all as you watch me do my nails. And if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around. Join the happy family. I'd love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below. And I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye!